So this morning I was walking the dog on the beach and uh, I'm in Long Island in the Hamptons and starting to see a horseshoe crab spawning coming in uh, on the shore. Generally they come in in the evening but it was low tide and uh, there were uh, females and males, um, just a few. The males were not close to the females and this little guy who has some really wonderful markings um, with crustaceans on his shell, I found several times upside down. So I decided to help him. And <laughs> I turned him over once or twice, and he was still upside down when I was coming back from the walk. So uh, there's a female down the beach that I am going to uh, take him closer to, so to see if he can uh, join on to her and they can uh, spawn. There are a couple of other females down the beach that are deep into the sand. Um, and uh, they have, um, one of them was pretty far up earlier this morning. I can come back to the beach and um, the tide has picked up, so she seems to be okay. Um, but she's too deep for a male to latch onto her. So this is one that uh, you can see my dog is now a horseshoe crab hound. Very good at finding horseshoe crabs these days. And uh, so I'm going to leave him here and see, I'll come back and check later um, and see if he's been able to uh, spawn and hook up, uh, hook up just like the kids do these days, right? And uh, this is just my favorite part of the season, uh, beginning of May before the full moon and by next week the red knots will be up and there will be hundreds of these gorgeous millions and millions of year old creatures all over the shores of the eastern seaboard.